Zcor here and today I'm gonna be bringing you guys a video with the good old FY103 I'm not gonna call it call it AK103 I'm not one of those fake new players who uses your real gun names like uh so so weird um, anyways jokes aside um, I'm recording this gameplay for a couple of reasons um, we, we were introduced to the game with that amazing spawn which definitely does not need fixing um, but the main focus of the video is, of course, the, like I said, the FY103. And um, there's a couple of reasons for that. So, first of all, um, well, at least this is what my original reason for wanting to record with this uh, gun was, was that I got this dope-ass skin that you probably noticed at this point, the Evil Santa skin. Honestly, I did not think I would like this skin. Um... Probably because I didn't really like the third anniversary one. The third anniversary one is like, I think, grayish and, and like a light blue or something like that. Um, and that one I found just very, very plain and boring and not very good looking, honestly. Um, and since, this, since the dominant color in this one is blue, um, I think I thought, like, um, I assumed that I wouldn't like this skin either. But after I got it and I played with it and I slapped it on the gun... I was actually like pretty amazed like it actually looks super super nice um it's probably i think like the combination of like the graffitis and all that stuff um but it, it looks hella nice and if but if anyone like um really likes this gun and wants a skin for it i say this is probably the best skin i don't remember what other skins there are for this gun but i think this is probably like the the, the number one skin for it um if I, I had to pick between the ones that i remember of of course um, the other reason I wanted to play with it, and um, it will lead into the third reason, is that um, <laughs> I've been, as usual, jumping back and forth between different weapons. Um, I've talked about this in the past, but I can never uh, settle on one rifle and, and stick to it. I keep switching uh, between different ones. Uh, I have been using the Bren mostly recently, because of its, some of its features that I'll cover in a video that I'll make on it, um, that I'll make when I use it. Um, but besides that, like, uh, that's the main one that I use, but I can't stick with that one either. Like, it does, it just doesn't feel right. And whenever I'm, like, feeling, uh, un unsure about what rifle to use and, and what gun to, you know, pick up and, and have a little, uh, some fun with, f for some reason, the FY103 is always, always gonna work. Like, for some reason... I, I'm never let down by the FY103 when I pick it up and, and, and uh, equip it and use it. I don't know what it is about this gun, and I'm pretty sure I have, like, more kills with this weapon alone than I have with any other weapon in the entire game. Probably my most weapons combined as well. I think I have, like, um, more than 25,000 kills, or I think around 25,000 kills. Somebody, like, pulled some stats from um, the stats website and they saw how many kills i had with the fy13 and they're like gosh what the hell like it, it was pretty amazing just to say that like i don't know what it is about this gun but it's like my my um what's it called my i'm forgetting the word but it's like my go-to weapon that will never let me down it's like uh, i can always count on this weapon in a way um and that le leads me to my third reason for recording this is because as i was deciding to equip this weapon again and use it somebody requested for me to actually make a video on it and they said that actually it's been buffed and i remember i remembered it being buffed some quite a while ago like i'd say like five six months ago but it also got another buff a little more recently um and i went and checked and i don't remember the exact date actually let me open it up here i have it in my history but it got another buff and the most recent buff was um a buff to the recoil. It, it got softer and more manageable recoil, quote unquote. Um, now, the thing is that, like, if you had not told me, if somebody, nobody had reminded me of this this buff, after using this weapon, I would not have told you that it's been it's been changed, that it's been buffed. So, um, right off the bat, I'm gonna say this 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 buff that they uh, apply to the recoil. It's not gonna make FI one of those like easy meta. Uh, weapons that you can just spray with 
Um, it's not going to become like a T27. Actually, can you spray T27? I don't know. Uh, um, it's not going to be your ARX or like, you know, those metal weapons that you can sp basically spray with. Um, I still would not recommend spraying with this weapon. Like, it just as you saw there and a, a lot of points in this gameplay, um, I miss a lot of kills just because um, obviously my aim isn't that good, but... I feel like most of the kills that I miss is because I, I let my rate of fire loose and my, like, my, um, my bullets, my, yeah, my, like, rate of fire loose and, like, I spray it and that's what, uh, wastes my, my time and my kill. Like, it, obviously, like, I'd say with any weapon it's best to tap fire or, or burst fire. But especially with the FY103, which has always been, like, the icon of, like, tap firing or, or, um, or burst firing, I think it still holds true that it still holds very much true that you you need it, it's much more efficient to tap fire with it or, or burst fire with it to make use of it effectively. Um, so yeah, like I said, the re the, the change in the buff they applied to it is barely noticeable. Like it's still, I'd say 99% the same. I think if I like in hindsight, if I look back at, on this gameplay that I'm gonna upload right now. Um, I was a bit more more forgiving of my the way I, I used the gun, and that I probably it didn't probably didn't bite me in the ass as much as it would have before because of the buff that they applied to it. But still, it's not enough for you to like be like, oh, FR13 is is like an easy gun now. I can use it. Um, it still holds true this to its nature and to its reputation of being like a a gun with um. A decent amount of recoil and great for tap firing and, and, and burst firing. So I, I really don't think this buff has made any difference on the gun. Um, but that's just my experience with it. Um, and I, I've been using like a couple of games, not too many. So <laughs> it's not very reliable and you should probably take it with a grain of salt. But that's what the opinion that I have on, sorry, that I have on the gun after it's been buffed. Um, and I mean, there's nothing else to say about this, this gun or, or this gameplay or whatever. Um, just, you, you guys know that Fallout 1 3 probably at this point, it's just a very, very reliable weapon that you can fall back on even if you have better weapons. Like I said, I have the CZ brand, but I could jump on, uh, equip this gun and, and still do, um, pretty well with it, even against like a lot of sweaties, um, if there's a lot of sweaties in the a match or whatever. Um, but yeah, that's gonna be it for this video on the F103. Um, I can make another video on it if you guys want. I don't know if you would want. Why would you want it? Uh, if there's any reason, if there is any reason you would want another video on this gun, though, please feel free to let me know. Or if you want a video on any other gun, that works as well. Um, but yeah, this has been the FY103 tweet, or the AK103 if you prefer, which has basically not changed. Um, and yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. There might be some of it left, I'm not sure. But anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.